This is a public announcement. This is a public announcement. The bubble gummies have been voting. The bubble gummies have chosen. The live making a bubblegum monster tonight is Sonic the Hedgehog. Again, right now you can hear us. Hey, Ooh, quite loud as well. Oh no, that's really loud. Really loud. Okay, let's just check. Get a sound check. We usually, usually we do sound checks, and then the first time that we don't do a sound check, it, the sound goes wrong. So yeah, <laughs> um, I reckon it's doing that weird, scary, loud music sound stuff. But I could be wrong. Let's turn that down and just check. See if that's okay. Yeah. I heard people were saying in the comments, can't hear you, can't hear you, but we know that because we, we already recognised. Okay. There we go. Cool, so it's all right. Okay. So we've got sound now? Is everyone um, okay? Was it? Well, we're always about a minute behind, so. A minute? Uh, a minute. They're, they're, thereabouts. It was about 20 seconds. Thereabouts. Uh, no, still no, still no things about people saying whether they can hear us or not. Um, I mean, I should be able to find out if I do this. No. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, that's this. Oh no, hold on. That's because I've, I've muted it. Here you go. Um, there you go. Yeah. So we got sound. Okay, that's good. And it sounded right, didn't it? Yeah. Right. Let's mute that so we don't get feedback. Okay. Um, right, should we do some, because we've got some new people here, Bone Dog, Ooh. hello, hello Bone, Dog. Bone Dog, um, Daniel Norton says that better not be your real moustache, it is, I spent the whole of the new year growing it, um, you know, I made sure I ate the right vitamins and minerals and yes, uh, and you have that special hair growing facial cream on, on your face, yep, yeah. yep, yeah. yeah. called a dog's arse, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and then um, yeah, so here it is. Uh, it may fall off halfway through. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we were saying no, they want me because you're going to try and keep it on long as, as long as you can. Yeah. Because you have to glue it on, don't you? I have to use this, which is basically uh, cat piss. Yep. And uh, it's not very pleasant, especially when it's like literally a few centimetres below your nose. <laughs> um, Anti SFM's in the room. Hey. Happy New Year to Happy New Year to you all. Yes, to Happy you New all. Year. God, we're still peaking way. Well, I, can, I can always turn that down. Yeah, I think that, that, that way. Right, there we go. Yeah, um, that won't be too loud. And she says she can hear us, which is great, loud and clear. Um, we've got Yuri Olivia. That's a good name. It is Yuri Olivia. Uh, Oliveira, Yuri Oliveira is a new name in the room. Craving Skate was saying that, um, according to Aeronautics, there's no reason, I have heard this before, why a bee should be able to fly because its wings are too small for its body. Yeah, I think that's bee. one of the things that is a kind of an urban myth thing. I oh, think, is it? Yeah, I think it's nonsense. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I thought I had heard, heard I've of heard of it, but yeah. it's one of those things like I've heard of the Slender Man as well. Oh, right, okay, so it's nice like nonsense. Like, yeah. thing um, Bone Dog subscribed and like thank you very much um, I did say to Lewis um, about the gallery because we've been discussing this so do you want to make the end well the reason we didn't release the gallery on Friday was if you haven't seen it yet you can click on the card above but it was obviously we released our sketch yeah our comedy sketch the Ouija board sketch which is why I'm wearing this which, stupid moustache why are you wearing a stupid moustache yeah. um, I don't actually want to wear this moustache it was out of some few people requesting it and because we love our viewers so much I decided to do it I think Fernando originally suggested it so it was right. challenged us to actually wearing you yeah. wearing a moustache and it was then mentioned very early in, in the um, comments so, so where's the moustache so it's, to itch my nose. Yeah. it's, it's quite uh, fluffy it's I'm surprised it hasn't, it's not annoying your nostrils no it's not too bad 
so yes, yeah, so that's why we didn't release the uh, gallery on Friday. So I was going to release it then uh, this weekend. But the thing is, is then we're like releasing every day and it upsets the algorithms of YouTube. You know what I mean? It doesn't work quite well for us because we want to try and spread the view time. So we're going to release it this Wednesday. But there's another reason why it's not going to be released Wednesday, isn't there? Yes. Do you want to announce that? Okay. I think you should do. Uh, yeah, so uh, tomorrow we are going to be releasing something else, which is... The Joy of Creation film with Iron Hall Cinema, who will also be releasing it on their channel. So they'll be releasing the first part, first chapter, and we're releasing the second chapter. Um, so it's not it's not the whole. I think some people expect the whole game. It's just two chapters, two cha- parts yeah. out of the game. So anyway, yeah. So that's what we'll be releasing uh, tomorrow. We haven't got an exact time yet, so it will be a little little surprise. Yes, but you will obviously be notified if you click the notification bell on our yeah. subscription page. Just make sure that little bell's ticked. Yeah. Um, and I will try. I will try and do a community post as well. So at least it will send out to those who do have the notifications. Um, oh, and ESFM goes. Yes, I'm so reacting to that. Well, cool. we'd love you to. Actually, uh, while you're here, uh, Celeste, I haven't finished it. So I haven't finished it. Along with many other things that I still haven't finished, but I'll quickly show you the. Um, I haven't got us on there. I've got to put us on there. But anyway, uh, the, the, the Dutch dragon. I've still got to do his. Oh, her, sorry, her hair, her feathers, and everything, and her towel. But it was causing a load of issues. So I'm kind of nearly there. And then we will 3D print it as well. Like we do with our. Well, we try to do with all of our different bubble gum monsters. But I thought I'd just quickly, quickly show you that. Um. Let me go back to us now quickly. Uh, where are we? There you go. And I'll just uh, add in another little box in there of us. So while we're sculpting, you can see what we're doing. Um, so let me do that now. Oh, right. Why we're not seeing ourselves? That's it. Um, yeah. There we go. Yes. So yeah. today is uh, Sonic the Hedgehog Day, isn't it? It is. Yep. Today we've got Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, which was voted to uh, voted for you, voted by you, voted by the Bubble Gummies. Um, actually, had forty nine percent of the vote. Forty nine percent of the vote. I haven't got. Yes, I have. I haven't got a pen though. Um, that should work. It should work, should it? That's the thing. I seem to have a big pot of pens, and none of them ever work. But that one, I think that works. works. So what I do is is what we normally do. Don't we? We normally ask people to. Uh, for their suggestions for making the next bubblegum monster yeah so I will make a note of, of, of them and I will scribble them down and we sort of pick five of what people tend, tend yeah. to ask and then you guys get to vote for them and the vote will open up tomorrow at 5pm GMT and then you can start voting on our community tab and there'll be more news about the community tab at the end of our video our stream today so if you don't know what the community tab is, it's all at the end. Um, are we having a bubblegum monster pitch? Um, don't know, Lewis. I don't, are we pitching? I don't think we're pitching. Pitching, pitching what? As in, oh, I'm, I'm thinking of it as a, a, a marketing pitch. Um, marketing pitch? Yeah, when people who? pitch. It's a, well, it just oh, says, are we having just... a bubblegum monster pitch? So I'm seeing it. Oh, yeah, I guess what well, it is yeah, kind of pitch, kind of pitch. That you can all pitch in your ideas and then we just sort of... Oh, I see, you're seeing it like that. Yeah, so that, that would... Yeah, I'm seeing it as, as... I'm understanding pitch as like a marketing pitch. And I thought, I didn't think we was doing a marketing type pitch. I think we but just... But to who? To the To... It just... I've just really yeah, confused. I think, yeah. Don't, don't worry. But no, I don't think we're pitching or it depends on what your definition of what a pitch is. Um... That moustache is awesome. Thank from you. Eric Ramirez gay maybe. Maybe the cat in the hat or thing one and thing two. Oh, yeah. That'd be quite a good yeah. suggestion. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, but what are we having? Cat in the hat or thing one and thing two? Well, thing one and thing two, yeah. Actually, I forgot. In thing one and thing two, they're just like big furry things, aren't they? From Dr. Zeus. Thing one. I can't remember if they're that different. Oh, that's right. Yeah. They've got the blue hair, haven't they? Yeah. Uh, the cat in, cat in the hat might be quite Cat in the hat, yeah. yeah. Go with cat in the hat. Because if we make thing hat. one, then everyone's going to want thing two. Even though they, yeah. They're actually the same though, aren't they? They are, yeah. Okay. Um, that was on over Christmas. 
Which one? Um, the um, Do- uh, Doctor. Yeah, uh, Grinch. No, the uh, Cat and Hat. Cat and Hat. Oh. Right. Mm. Because uh, I keep thinking they were both played by Jim Carrey, but they weren't, weren't they? One was Mike Myers and one was Jim Carrey. Yeah, Mike Grinch Myers was... played Cat in the Hat, right. which was Jim Carrey. <clears throat> um, do Bowser. Oh, we'd like... Oh, yeah, yeah. That was suggested before and never yeah. got through the vote, so we're definitely putting Bowser, Bowser. down. Right, so the suggestions can keep coming in. Um, While they're coming in, what I'll do is I'll just... Get started. Um, well, yeah, I'll transition over again, and I'll show you the finished... Um, Though we've still got 3D printing, as we have a backlog of stuff at the moment, because Christmas, that annoying thing that gets in the way of Christmas, <laughs> just completely throws everything. Um, so we also did over Christmas, we did the Krampus, which is you kind of finished. Um, yeah, so, oh, why is not let me rotate around him? It's not frozen up for some reason. There we go. He's got that funny inner mouth thing going on. Um, so yeah, and he's got these chains on him and things like that. So that has got to be 3D printed, which would be quite interesting to see if you can successfully do the chains and stuff. Um, but what we were thinking is maybe printing him separately so everything's a little bit easier for you to 3D print. Like the body, the head and the hands. But anyway, that's Krampus. Um, and so as we've just been discussing, we are doing today, we are going to do Sonic. Sonic. So um, I will start by just uh, creating a new, creating a new, uh, fresh scene. Yes. I so said while that's going through, um, well, uh, we've got uh, Sinkum's in the room. Me. He likes that Chica poster now, but in the background. Yeah, that's in, uh, you'll find that in our film, which is coming out tomorrow. Yeah. Um, oh, it's hot in Brazil. Cassio or C four S S I O is saying it's hot in Brazil because it's freezing here and it's freezing in America, isn't it as well? Um, Bone Dog is actually saying, "Could we do Pikachu? Is one of the best Pokemon? Please do it." But we've actually done Pikachu. Done Pikachu. We have done Pikachu. Um, I think have we done a video on him though? When we made him, I can't remember. No, at that time we. Oh no, it was yeah we did because do you remember that was the time I was ill. Oh, okay. Um, and you did, yeah, you did Pikachu. Um, you could do Yoda. Yeah. I, d- I like that, especially Yoda's with um, Star Wars being very popular at the moment. We like the idea of Yoda. Um, okay, so I think Sonic has kind of got just a round head, hasn't he, really? Pretty much. So let's just start with a round head. And what I'll do is I'll just etch in his eyes... Well, roughly where they're going to be, which is kind of here. Oh, put symmetry on that help. There we go. And they go. How's that moustache? People are loving your moustache. Maybe I'll just, I'll just keep it. Actually, no. <laughs> That's not a good idea. Okay, so this is his like brow of his where his eyes go. And then kind of go down like that, don't they? And then his mouth. I'm not sure. He's got, yeah, he's got like a. It goes like from the front. I mean, that actually looks a bit like a hot dog, doesn't it? Or a sauce, you know what I mean? That sort of. Yeah. Part of it. Um. Da, 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 da. Oh, poo poo! Uh, was what was once poop poop is now hey nobody um, or ha nobody. He's changed his uh, his, his name. Um, he's in the room, so it's good to see him. Uh, Lewis Frankmore is obviously in the room. Um, Just find another view of Sonic. Oh, uh, Cobillion. Cobillion is another Pokemon character. Let's just have a quick look and see see what he's like. Co- isn't that the one with a sort of rock face? Um, C O B I L I A N. C O B. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. L I. Cabalion. Could that be him? 
Yes, Cabalion. Oh, right, yeah, I don't know that one. That's, um, oh, it's a bit like, I'd say it was, it's a bit like, I would have said, the, um, My Little Pony we've done. It's obviously not, it's, um, but it's a similar, right. similar one to the My Little Pony. Maybe, maybe that could make, I'll make a note of it, but it, whether it makes the vote this time round. Um, current Ballion. Okay. Um, it's got these big sort of like browns, isn't it? Okay, Eric Ramirez Gaming. Can you guys do a calib collaboration with me? I have a live stream. Some of my subs want a live action Secrets of the Demon. I thought you might be able to help me since you specialise in animation. That would be cool. It would be cool. We were, I always open up open to collaborations um we've got a few planned already haven't we? we have we have got a few planned there and that's the problem is it, it's very easy to commit say yeah we'll, we'll do it but we're talking about months and months in advance so when we started speaking to Arnold cinema that was i think it was back in june july this year yeah. it's it's a long drawn out process uh, mainly because obviously peter's work commitments um as well as mine and it's it's tricky but we'll definitely keep in touch though um eric did you get your poster by the way um oh what else is it death killer hello that's death killer good name. that's a cool name actually although it doesn't mean you kill death yeah because then then you're kind of in a paradox yeah because if you kill death and he dies then there's no, no death, death so you can't be a killer anymore well you can still be a killer but how can you kill stuff if, cause kill oh because they won't die yeah they can't yeah you can't be mm. a killer yeah. uh, in a way what's that that's, that's reminding me a little bit like when you started Bendy well, they're quite similar, aren't they, in terms of, like, they're based basically on Disney kind of characters, aren't they? Both Sonic and... They've got the big eyes and the... Yeah. Yeah, it's all kind of the same thing. But uh, let's just keep going. Let's see what we come up with. Anti-SFM says, Do you make models with a mouse or do you use some kind of drawing pad? I use a drawing pad, a Wacom. Wacom tablet. And there's actually yeah. details of the Wacom tablet in the description below if you want to find out where it's you a get lot, It's a them. lot easier doing it that way than doing it with a um, mouse. I mean, you've used what, a tablet for years, haven't you? Yeah, since about 2002, 2003. I remember that's when you set your place down in Brighton. Yeah. You just know, see it sitting there. Um... Okay, oh well, Eric Ramirez Gaming. Should make it a bit smaller as it is. Yeah. Um, you want to check your email, Eric. It was a digital signed screenshot. It's a digital signed screenshot. Oh, you're referring to the... the oh, he's referring to the posters we sent out about six months ago so if you if you haven't got it oh we'll, we'll have to i'll have to speak to peter to see what is, we, we can do maybe i can print up another one um sure what happened to rebecca well over christmas rebecca was obviously spending time with her son and her family and the like for the festive period mm -hmm. today she's actually got a commitment as well um, busy bee, yeah. She is a busy bee, busy bee, but she has said to, said to me that she would try and join us for next week, next Monday, which would be nice to welcome her back. Um, Slender Man is another suggestion for a three D print. Yeah, well, there's a Slender Man movie coming out, which I saw the trailer for today, and it looks really bad. But oh, no. you never know; it might be good. So, is yeah. Slender Man going to make the list? Yeah, it might as well. it'll be down to you guys anyway. What you'd prefer? Because when the voting opens uh, tomorrow, we we did quite well actually. We got um, over two hundred, I think about two hundred fifty or two hundred sixty votes 
for, yeah. for this one, of which fifty percent of it was was for Sonic. So we we do we do listen to you guys, and it's down down to you. Uh, the next gallery is planning to be this Friday. This this Friday. So he's he's basically he's got these spikes isn't he, in his head, which are, if you look they're kind of just like big. Sh- the first one's just like a big shark fin, isn't it? So what I'm going to do is mask out this area where it'll be protruding from, and then reverse the mask like I do numbers of times, and then hopefully we can just pull it out and kind of make that spike shape, right? Yeah, I think there was um there was a video um on YouTube. Well, there's there's a guy on YouTube um which looks at the evolution of games characters oh, over the years. Cool. Um, and he's he's done what he's done one for uh, I think he's done one for Mario. He's certainly done one for Sonic. Um, so yeah, we'll have to see what that actually is and why it's changed. Because even on your reference photos, isn't there? Yeah, it's like the old ones where he's got like really long legs, isn't there? And the ones where he's got like slightly less long. Legs. And as Rusty Rocket, welcome to the room. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, oh, Warrior X two six nine. So I didn't forget you. I did forget you, but. Uh, Higher, um, <laughs> Rusty Rocket. Um, he said, "Are we doing a classic Sonic or modern Sonic?" Which is just what we're talking about. The well, evolution. yeah, I think because I'm old and so is Stuart. Where we, I remember when Sonic came out. I actually remember my brother got a Mega Drive. Yeah, exactly. and then it, it, what, it was his first game was Sonic. It was like, wow, look at the graphics, are amazing. They're like three D, but they're not. And. Um, and yeah, so it's just kind of, uh, I guess that's you know our favourite times <laughs> was uh, back thirty years ago. So we're gonna go with the thirty-year-old Sonic, the nineteen ninety-one one. Oh god, it sounds so long. When people as well, what was it? Um, someone said to me, "God, you're old." Yeah, no, they said that the people who were born in the noughties are now adults, or can actually now be eighteen. And you think that is scary? That is just like because two thousand doesn't seem that long ago. To be honest, I can remember quite clearly the two thousand one and all the rest of it. Yeah, the early two thousand. Yeah. Think oh, I think someone is uh, eighteen already. Um, but it takes ages to get to eighteen, doesn't it? it? Feels like that. Like if you put all your life into what you feel like is the right proportion, getting to eighteen seems to take about thirty-seven years. And then the rest of my life is just after 18, basically, just goes, yeah, pretty much. Um, yeah, no, it, it is it, it is disproportionate, isn't it? You don't, like, so you're sitting there, especially when you're at school, just, that seems like last forever. Um, and then, oh, because my daughter is going to be finishing school, or oh, certainly her, she go on to sixth form. I can't believe that. But yeah, that's, I mean, she's, she's so like fourth when, year. I remember when she was like, one just, just it's just so so quick um, uh, Bone Dog wants to know if we could do a 3D a model of 3D Earth what we do is we, we could make him a bubblegum monster so it's normally a character or, or something yeah. isn't it yeah so we don't no, that is a cool idea um, but it would be something we'd probably do yeah it's not it has to be that is one of the criteria we have it has, it has to be a character I suppose you could put a big face on it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, um, does... Uh, I mean, because... I mean, we obviously... We, we, we're putting things down here, or people are now suggesting things, but originally you started out making... You know, how it all started was... Yeah. It was some... People would suggest something like a phoenix, and you did it for them as their character, which had appeared yeah. on, the, on our banner. Um... Okay, so oh, two D's in the room. Higher two D. Yeah, um, sorry, you still haven't finished two D. Uh, still working on it. MBJ Gaming, hello. And so we're looking for a fifth suggestion. There's we've got three here. We've got um, Purple Guy, Stormtrooper, and oh no, the other one was um, was the the three D Earth. So. Uh, 
O2D saying that they sent some more stuff or we'll be sending some more stuff for the gallery, which would be great. Cool. Um, and the Diamond Sheep is in the room. We haven't seen you for a little while. Hello, Diamond Sheep. Hey, Diamond Sheep. I'd say, I know, I know we've got, oh, we've got Yoda this time. Maybe we should do a Stormtrooper, a Stormtrooper next time. Yeah, I'll put it in the vote for next time, but people are saying oh, a Stormtrooper. I know it's the same person, so yeah. Uh, Eric Ramirez Gaming. Just are, save that. Are either of you left-handed? Yes, I am. Peter's left-handed, yes. Um, uh, sunk. Oh yeah, what happened to 2D from the Gorillas? I just haven't finished it. Oh right, it's just it's been asked. Yeah, I still haven't. I've done. I've been playing catch up. So we've got Freddy is finished. Krampus is finished. Dutch Angel Dragon is nearly finished. And then the next one will be 2D. 2D. And then hopefully we will get most of Sonic finished today. Hopefully, we shall see. See how we go. Um. Oh, Bone Doll's got a nip off. He's got to do something. Don't worry. Oh, Come okay. and join us. Yeah, thanks off the... Uh, 2D in. loves the moustache. Thanks. So. And it's really actually me. staying on this time. Oh, it was staying on more than it was when you was, we was filming. Well, the thing is, when we were filming, it was um, me having to shout a lot, wasn't it? Yeah. In the sketch, so that's why. So he's got quite a round body, so I'm going to try and... Um... Yeah, Eric Ramirez was saying that what he'd do is he'll, he'll do the filming and then ask us to do the animation. Okay. Um, but yeah, like like we said, Eric, it's it will have to take a slot down, yeah, down the mean, line. It really does depend on how much, because the problem with the animation is it always takes ages. Um, I don't know what it is, to be fair. What's it's the odd one out? Because uh, Craving State Skate is jumping up and down, wanting us to do odd one is out. Odd one is... Out. Is that um, is that like another one of these sort of um, things that people do, like the ice bucket challenge, or what's the, what's the one they do? People have done YouTube. YouTube YouTube's YouTube's have one done. Is out. We got that marshmallow man. Oh, as a character. I see yeah, oh, yeah, a, yeah. Sorry, as a three D. Oh, character. I see what you mean. Um, oh. oh. I think we should get a little portal for you. I oh, know. Just get. Bear right. I come oh. straight from work and I just uh, I forget to pass go. <laughs> get him a little bag that you can attach. Um. So yeah, I'm just trying to sort of get the proportions of his body. He's actually got a really little body. It's tiny. Let's make it even smaller than that. That size, really, his actual body. Tiny. His head's almost twice the size, I think. But anyhow, I'm just trying to round it off a little bit. Uh, talk amongst yourselves, because I can't actually see the uh, chat, unfortunately. Uh, okay, that'll do. How many f spikes has he got in his back? Looks like he's got one. I thought he'd have more than that. One and a bit. Kind of got a little towel thing sticking out as well. So let's do that. So it's got one kind of here. If I can paint that on. Like that. Well, we're at X269. Love the. Um our last sketch by the way oh cool yeah I mean it's more of our traditional sketch where we just do something that we would particularly find funny ourselves um, rather than it being based on any games or anything like that so glad you enjoyed it um, we'll, we'll have to do a frequently asked questions and put it as a as a as a video because we've got the same quick again. How, how do we come up with the name uh, Bubblegum yeah. Monsters? So yeah. we, we will do that one day. I think we'll, we'll, we'll sit down and we'll see what the 10 most popular questions are and maybe do a, a, a Q&A. Um, oh, Odd One... Odd One's out. Is it? Is he, is a YouTuber. Um, do Tank Girl. Yeah, that's a cool one. Um... 
and I'd love to go do antiseptikide no just joking I'm pretty much addicted to him and darker YouTube so uh, uh, maybe a Digimon Bigfoot with MBJ gaming we actually we've done a Bigfoot, done Bigfoot. we have done a Bigfoot that's in there somewhere um, you should make Sherlock but the um, with a detective based on yeah is that on the actual TV series or just like a caricature of yeah, let, let us know, Diamond Sheep, where, where you're getting at. Um, what reference of Sherlock are we talking about? Um, MBJ Gaming said, this looks really cool so far. Cool. You're good at this. <laughs> Thanks. It's, uh... How long have you been working with ZBrush? Um, something like 2005, I think. Something like that. What did you use before? I, we just didn't. There wasn't any. I mean, you did 3D, but it was like basic sort of blocks. Like you had to do it the old school way of doing stuff by making things out of polygons, basically. That was the old light life days. Yeah, we which sure, you still use. People still use because it, it has its uses as well. But um, ZBrush for sculpting is the, just the you know just you can the, the, these other ones have tried to catch up with sculpting it built in. Like Maya's got it built in now, but it's just, I just don't like it at all. I much prefer using ZBrush. Would you say that you'd use ZBrush for sort of stuff which is more organic? Yeah, totally, yeah. yeah. But you can use it. They've tried to sort of like make it more um, accessible for hard surface stuff as well, which it can do now. I'm just not very good at it because I just don't do hard surface stuff much in ZBrush, but you can definitely do it. And there's loads of tutorials if that's something that you're interested in looking into. Um, then, yeah, it's definitely got some good tools now. I mean, what would be lovely would be able to just use just use ZBrush all the time, but unfortunately, because of things like creating animations and particle effects and just everything else that comes with 3D, it doesn't do it all. It only does really modelling and some painting as well. But yeah, it'd be great to be able to just use ZBrush. I much prefer to Maya. I think because was one of your, the first ones you did on ZBrush, wasn't that your your, your granddad? Or something? Yeah, it was, wasn't it? It was the yeah. face. Well, because it's it was just that kind of realization that I could suddenly make stuff that look all like the wrinkles and creases and stuff. So I thought, well, my granddad's really wrinkly. <laughs> I'll, I'll just use him as a test subject. Uh, okay, let's make it. There's um, I tell you what, there's a lot of um people saying that they'd actually quite like us to do a video answering the the, the sort. Of Questions, Trust yeah. Oh, okay. So they'd like to, as Eric Ramirez puts it, um, I'd want to see and hear those memories. Okay. Of so I mean, yes, yeah, so I think yeah, that's that's a, a very strong possibility. Then I think we we should do something along those lines. Um, maybe at the we could do a link at the end of that um, our trailer for new people, and then. I mean, yeah, I mean, we really need to do a new trailer, to be honest. Yeah. That is something we need to do. If you wonder what I'm doing here, I'm just making these shoes. Or a shoe, and then I'll just duplicate that shoe into another shoe. Uh, the Diamond Sheep says the character, the detective of a Sherlock. So... Because we could do it as a uh, as a busker game, couldn't we? A busk? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, th I, think that's, I think that's a good suggestion. I thought you said a busk again. I was like, what's a busk again? <laughs> I see now, have you got over your cold yet? No, well, I have. I've just got this annoying fruit thing now, which just seems to have like It's probably some starch, to be honest. Because <laughs> I, 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 for me, it's, it's, it's just constantly nasal, the headaches. Yeah, it's annoying, isn't it? It just won't go. It's, yeah, constant thing. Um, the first way to 3D print is wax. You can make a wax hand and stuff yeah in fact um you did a well you used to do um some of the stuff you did with the latex wasn't it yeah silicon wasn't silicon, it? silicon that's it yeah we made a we used it in quite a lot of our sketches haven't we the hand oh the hand, yeah we have tried to use that in fact quite our money's worth well it has and if we we did used to do a spot the hand didn't we yeah which I eggnog think, on the world really likes yeah it, it, it's always get gets it to be fair in fact maybe we could do something like that for our next sketch like Should, include the yeah. hand in and yeah so, so we're going to do the we're going to do the plot luck one next aren't we because we have promised that for about four months now and we still haven't got around to doing it uh, that is the plan yeah we've got a, a, 
a rough idea of what well it's, it's kind of molded isn't it because the scripts is um, yeah a Freddy costume um, get me get me to, get me to the chopper yeah does it get to the chopper and, and mushrooms from um, okay 2d asks um, has anyone got any ideas on what I could use for online drawing um, like normal traditional 2d art I don't whether well, the because most people just use Photoshop. A Photoshop or paint or um, Coral Draw. N- n- there's another one. What was it called? I um, can't remember. But there are there are a number of, there are a number of packages for just doing yeah yeah your, your standard drawing stuff. Um, MBJ Gaming. How long would it take to make the next FNAF episode? Well, we've actually got a Joy of Creation, which we've been doing in collaboration with Iron Hall Cinema. And at last discussions with Iron Horse, they were saying that it's going to be released tomorrow. So that's where they do the first part, the chapter, one first chapter, and we're following up with a second chapter. And it is our intention, if everything works out well, that we'll be releasing that tomorrow. So that's going to be our next FNAF um, episode. Uh, who remembers The Last Guardian? Uh, it's, uh, there's, uh, there's two different films that confuse it. Last, there's one with owls that was about, and, but I can't remember what the other one was about. And I'm sure they've both got Guardian in the name, but I can't. Yeah, remember. It, it's um, Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy is the one which has got the. But no, no, it's not Guardians of the Galaxy. That's um, the Marvel. Marvel. No, I'm thinking it was. Oh, it, yeah, there's one with these owls in it. But there's another one as well. I can't remember what it, what it was. I'll tell you another thing I saw um, recently. And I I managed to flip through. I was on channels and I, I just caught it. I think it was like even on something like Channel 4. Um, and couldn't stop watching it. And it was The Labyrinth. Oh, yeah. And for some reason, that's, I mean, I think it might have been to do with, obviously, um, because David Bowie obviously just recently passed, suddenly. What, I think it might have been last year. You're talking about? No, it was this year. So maybe it wasn't. Or well, the year before, actually. I think did he? I think it might have been 2017, but it was. The it was the beginning. Wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was the beginning of 2017. Um, um, so yeah, this is going to be his um, his shoes. Uh, yeah, Eric. What we we'll do is we'll, we'll 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 get back get back to you um, on the co- collaboration. Um, it really uh, uh, the way everything works is the wheels do turn, but sometimes very slowly. So we will uh, as soon as we know what sort of slot we've got, we can get get back to you. Um, Craven Skate's got to go, but thank you very much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for coming. Um, Bone dog's got to go for something to eat. Enjoy your dinner. It's important you've got to eat. I've learnt how to invert on a scooter. Invert mm. on, on a, a scooter. scooter. I l- that. Well, the only one I'm I'm thinking we're going to invert. Uh, mm. Yeah, no, sorry. I that. Would like to, love to know what that trick is. To be honest, diamond sheep. Uh, 2D loves the labyrinth. Uh, gaming with Chris two two five four. Hello, he's just joined. Oh, cool. Good. Kevin Skates says bye. 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 Roxy N A Reitz. N A Reitz. Um, oh, that's a new name. It says hello. 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 Uh, Tegan McGee. I think it's, we are getting some new names popping in and out. Um, hello. That's a good name. Um, 2D also likes Moulin Rouge. I haven't actually seen the film. I mean, yeah, I thought watch. it was right up your street, that sort of thing. Yeah, no, I haven't. I haven't seen it. Um, no, I, think, I don't know if I have actually. I've seen bits of it, but I don't, don't know if I've seen There's a new FNAF six song called Labyrinth. Oh, is it? Yeah. Thank you, Warwick. We'll have to check that. Charlie two three zero six. Hi. Hello. Um. And he's also our biggest fan. So it's cool. good to know. Thank you very much, Charlie. I do you like our biggest fans? Oh. 
trying to make his this is his socks if anyone's wondering I was going to say it looks like a yo-yo it does a bit doesn't it but no it's his or a skateboard wheel no a skateboard wheel is more is yeah it's built for the so um Oh, okay, so he's saying if we want to know what it is to invert on a scooter, we check out Raymond Warner. Mm -hmm. um, uh, Roxy uh, Narit says, uh, have you noticed me? I've heard my cat. Um, Adrian Bond, the gamer, have you seen Happy Death Day? No. No. Happy Death Day. Happy Death, Death Day. Day. I don't know what that is. Is it a film? I tell you what that looks very quickly now. Is the um, you haven't seen? Um, have, you, have you seen uh, Turbo? No, you, the, you you mentioned it. You seem to like that film very much because you've mentioned it twice now. Every time we do something. Yeah, because that looks like that looks like one of the um, snails. Right. You see snails and everything. Don't yeah, you? I, I don't. Yeah, maybe yeah. that's um, that's really weird because um, when Ellie did that drawing, she did a snail, didn't she? She did. Yeah. Uh, maybe it's something runs deep in our DNA. Uh, Tegan McGee came from Bill's channel, so thank Bill for sending you over. Yeah, we're doing something with Bill as well, actually. Again, it's been a while. Um, not till probably another few weeks, but yeah, there's something coming out with Bill. Be fun. Guys, you're 27 already. Yeah. Okay, let me get on and stick his boot on him. Um, if you guys love your fans, say bubble gummies. Well, we do bubble gummies. We do bubble gummies. We definitely do. Um, yes, Turbo is that speedy snail MBG gaming. I think. I think the. Crocky, this. I think the proportions are maybe slightly adrift. What's going on there? Oh, that's. Uh... And there he looks like um, uh... a snail from Turbo. No, uh, Woody Woodpecker. Oh, okay. No, it's not. I'm trying to find what I did with his boot. Which one's the right one? It should be one of these. Why is it all. Oh, I'm getting confused now. Is that one? No, that's just a sphere. Sorry, I'm trying okay. to find what to do with his boot. I made it all up, didn't I? I put it all yeah. together, and now I can't find it. Open that thing again, because I thought I saw it. Let me go back through. It's not that one. It's that one. Okay. Uh, maybe after. Mm, I can't remember. This is where things get a bit. Hey, I think I know what I should do. Okay, let's try again. <clears throat> Boot in the face. <laughs> yes. Um, stunk. Scared, it? Oh, that's a tricky one. Do you guys have any alter egos? It's from Anti SFM. We do need to speak, actually, Celeste, because we, we have discussed that we're doing some sort of collaboration. She does like her alter egos. Celeste. I think Celeste's got about 15. Yeah. <laughs> and um, they all generally involve stabbing and killing. Definitely don't want to be around her house at night, I don't think. <laughs> okay, so that's one sure. Oh, we've got... Let's duplicate that. 31 thumbs up as someone just said the thing is, is we will oh hold on you know we started with three thumbs down yeah we're now down to two thumbs down oh that's right so maybe someone realized that it wasn't it wasn't just an image and we were yes uh what was the best video guys you've ever made what was the best video we did actually answer this last, last was it uh, during the christmas uh, no, blog, wasn't that was it? slightly different wasn't it because that was what was the one you had the most fun making i think was that that was that question wasn't it it was yeah which, it was, is, it was, which is slightly different to which was the best one because you, you said baggage wasn't it you'd brought up baggage uh, yeah that was probably the one I put the most effort into yeah because yeah. um, that was six months of my life that was just got to do his eyes like that. 
Which, funny enough, is probably the one that the least amount of people have seen. We uh, say so the questions are, are coming in thick and fast. We we'll have to, we will have to do. Um, I think may, may, maybe we'll have to uh, canvas a, you know what questions people want to ask or want us to answer. Yeah. Are the popular ones, and then um, only thing with the vote is that uh, you can only at list five. Maybe we could do it over a couple of weeks or something. But yeah, we, we'll, we'll do that because this, this this one is like, what movies do we like to watch? Again, we've had that in and around. So we, I think we should do it a bit like that. Yeah, we'll, we'll come up with something. Have you ever made Jeff the Killer? No. I don't know what Jeff the Killer is. What's Jeff the Killer? I don't know Jeff the Killer is. I can research him. But you're being told off by um, uh, Celeste. She says, Peter, how dare you? I have three and they're nice ones. Depends what you... Oh, he looks... Oh. That's... Jigsaw, isn't it? Uh, the puppet, Billy. Um, yeah, depends what you... Um, deem as nice. Uh, they all look... They're all a little bit mad from what I've seen. Uh, you should make evil... Morty from Rick and Morty. Oh yeah. Well, we we, we oh we have got the five. We've got Cat in the Hat, Bowser, and I'm assuming Bowser's the one from uh, Mario, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Yoda, Slender Man, and Sherlock. So the voting for those will be up. A bit smaller, actually. Um, to in fact, I might even try and get the vote up tonight. Okay. But, um, no, it will it will be from tomorrow. So not tonight? Not tonight, no. For 5pm tomorrow. Okay. And then we'll have the, the, the vote up there and you guys can start voting. And obviously it will close on s probably Sunday when yes. we're live again with the next Making a Bubblegum Monster, which you guys will choose um, on Monday. Bubblegum Monster, in your new sketch, did Stuart die because his face appeared above the board? Yeah. Uh, no, it wasn't Stuart. That was it, it was Agnes. Agnes. Agnes, yeah. Mm. Poor old Agnes. Poor old Agnes. They seemed to offend some people, didn't they? Is that right? No, I think that was one person was talking about the video might get demonetised because I don't know. it was I don't know. I don't, offensive, I don't, but okay. I don't see how I don't that thing. But I don't, I don't know. People weren't that against Agnes. Are you kidding, Agnes? No, she, well, she was annoying. Yeah. Wasn't she? Um. Yeah, who's our favourite FNAF character? Um, okay, so let's make his hands now. Quickly. Um, apart from the figure, uh, fingers, um, again, it's all very Mickey Mouse, aren't they? Yeah. Um, I hate it when you do that. What, save it? When you replace it. Oh, well, I always yeah. think if it crashes now. Yeah, that would be annoying. Mm. Um, okay, let's um, let's do the old Zed Spheres thing, which is always good, I think, for making cartoon hands. So, you guys have probably seen this before. I love you anyway. So, you're going to make a farm. This will be his farm. I'll, I'll write down Sponge I'll write down Spongebob um, Charlie but the the five which you can vote on which will be up tomorrow include Cat in the Hat Bowser Yoda Slender Man and Sherlock but I've made another note of it because it could feature in another one especially if you come back and remind us that's what you want because we do let you guys choose what you want to see being modelled each week we do this um NTSF then gives you an update. She goes, well, I have more than three, but only three are nice. They don't like to kill. So you have 15. Yeah. <laughs> they don't like to kill, but one is possessed by a killer. So uh, you should do a 360 vid. Um, <laughs> you need a 360 camera, don't you? I just thought that finger. <laughs> that's what I think of what Celeste is saying. Yeah. Um, 
MBJ Gaming. Have you watched the movie Harry Potter? I've watched all I've never s- heard of it. Have you? You've never watched Harry Potter? Yeah, never, I've never heard of it. Um, Sounds rubbish. It won't be successful. Gabriel PM. Hello, thanks for joining. Um, loves our video, uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh, cool. Which Great. it might please you to know that we have a Joy of Creation collaboration coming out with uh, Einhorn Cinema. And as it stands, should be released tomorrow, unless there's any yeah. changes from their end. But we're ready to go. Um, Warrior X269, um, I noticed you did send, send some stuff. Uh, whether the video or not, I can't remember. Um, but if you sent it to us, I'll, I'll double check. In fact, I can do that now and just, just double check to see if we've got it. I remember a couple of people sent to see could send us um, a video. Let's have a. So that's uh, this kind of cartoon hand, and then we do the magic thing where we press this here, and it should sort of skin it all. And you're kind of halfway there then to actually have it done. Just need to kind of smooth it all over a bit. Actually, Warrior, no. When the last um, email I got from you was on the first uh, of the twelfth, two thousand seventeen. So first of December. Uh, Charlie two three oh six is asking if we have Instagram. We do. We do. And if you check in the description below, it's got all our links to all our social media sites. Um, and then we're not brilliant on it, are we? We don't use it all the time. No. Um, uh, Diamond Sheep's got to go. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye, Diamond Sheep. Um, Bone Dog says, I thought you were having your dinner, Bone Dog. Um, can you make a Chaos Gem floating by him because that's how he turns into Supersonic? Uh, yeah, the only thing is, I've got 3D printed. I mean, we could do it. But, uh,. Yeah, I was gonna say it would be a bit tricky with a three D print. Um, uh, Prody sent you a link to the video. Prody sent you a link. That's Warrior. Um, I, I, we, we didn't. Did, I don't think we got that. You got to remember the spam filters as well. It's quite sensitive. So if you can just resend it, that'd be great. NCSFM says, do you guys have Musical.ly yet? Musical.ly. I don't know, have we? Someone set up a Musical.ly fan page oh, yeah, for yeah. us. Oh, yeah, yeah. We still need to uh, do it. Um, but, yeah, but we can't post on it because it's not our page, uh, is it? I don't know. So, um, but, yeah, we... We are, let's say, we, we need to do something, Celeste, don't we? Um, regarding the Musical.ly thing, because I think we could do a, a collaboration there. I think it was the idea, wasn't it? We was going to do yeah. something. Don't know how how it would would work. It we'd, we need to have a chat, see what we can do. Um, <laughs> MBJ Gaming goes. Could you make um, SpongeBob Snail Gary? Oh yeah. Oh, it's all about snails. Snail. Yeah. Um, Gabriel is from Portugal. Hey. Um, Portugal, yeah. How warm is Portugal at I the moment? I don't. Yeah. I'd imagine. Uh, I've never been to Portugal. I've been to Madeira. We're looking at going this year, actually, Portugal. Oh, yeah. My uncle, uh, in fact, I think he sold it now. He had a place in Portugal. But I've never been. I've always wanted to go. It sounds... In fact, the uh, manager of our pub's Portuguese. So that was a really boring fact. Just for you guys might want to know. <laughs> It's a shame he still doesn't have it because it would save him loads of money. What's that? He still had his place. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. Um, ah, he mistyped it. Um, which is why we haven't got it. And that's Warrior who was saying about Sunny. So oh, there you go. It's good that yeah. you checked. Um, Bone Dog is from Ohio. Aren't, shouldn't you be at school at this time of day? Where's Ohio in relation to like the time zone? Middle, sort of north between. There's New York, and then it goes along, does it? And then Ohio's kind of. Is it kind of in the middle? 
at the top part, but sort of in the middle, or more, yeah, to, so the, what more time to the east. I think would they have been um, about six hours behind or something? Mm. Um, is it cold there? Because it it's freezing, isn't it? In um, New York and New stuff. York, yeah. It was. Um, they have a massive. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's cold here, but I have read yesterday that with the wind chill, it was like minus 79 or something. Crikey. I know. They were saying that if you go out, you're f- you could actually get frostbite in 10 minutes on your face. So basically, don't go out. I'm making a note of that, um, Warrior, uh, but you may have to remind me on the next next gallery. Um, yeah, because I was saying that, that video, that news thing where he throws water in the air and it comes oh, down yeah. snow, snow. Did anyone try that? Um, I don't know if they've done that on it over there. It'll come down as a nice block in the back of the head. <laughs> uh, did Peter go to college where to specialise in animation or the computer skills? No. Well, I'm self-taught. Self-taught. Um, but I did, in 2009, do a year and a half online animation course with a online um, the online course is called Animation Mentor it's still going and it's taught by like Pixar and uh, DreamWorks a lot of the mentors are from these big animation houses so it was really useful actually it was really cool it's not cheap but then it's not as expensive as going to an actual college or university it was I think it was £1,500 for a year and a half Oh, that's not too bad. I thought it was. It was well, mind you, saying that you had to upgrade. So I'm talking rubbish. Um, no, it wasn't fifteen hundred. It was fifteen thousand. I was going to say, yeah, because yeah. I thought it was in the thousands. Yeah. Um, so it wasn't cheap, but it, but compared to if you went to uni for three years, it would cost you fifty grand, or fifty thousand pounds. So it's not bad, really, compared to that. And you're taught by actual people that work in the industry rather than people that just a just teach it and don't actually work in the industry. Yeah, that's. I suppose that's the um, uh, biggest advantage of it, wasn't it? You actually, when you're yeah. talking to them, they actually know they've had experience. Yeah, they were it. like working. I can't remember what films they were working on at the time. I think it was Avatar. The guy that was was one of my mentors. He was working on Avatar at, at the time. Um, uh, Anti SFM saying, "Do you have any alter egos?" Oh yeah, because we're trying to. Yeah, yeah, we're trying to work on that. Um, or who are your favourite characters? Uh, my favourite characters as in like a cartoon character or like a, just a villain or a just a character in general I'm just trying to think of a uh, Charlie's got to go no problems Charlie thanks very much for joining us I do like um, what's his name from Back to the Future the doc the doc uh, Emmett Brown yeah yeah so I must have been sort of go through films and I'm trying to sort of cast my mind back yeah, yeah a, lot, a lot of mine would be film based characters yeah but again now even saying that I, I couldn't I mean at one at one point I was a uh, I still am I suppose was a huge fan of the Blues Brothers so and um, I, I liked uh, Elwood Blues um yeah, no. Oh, as in characters you go, you, we did. Oh God, um, characters we did. I think um, I haven't really made any um, myself though, other than this one. Maybe I should just inherit the moustache and just go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just be. Um, what was his name? Um, Jebediah. Jebediah. Yeah. Just become Jebediah. Okay, let's stick his hands on his body. He's got his boots. And then we've got a pen. His hands. Looks like oh, a teddy bear. I was going to say, yeah. It's <laughs> 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 quite freaky. He's got quite big hands, though. So um, it's a little bit like kind of kin- uh, kindergarten egg to give or what they're called. Are oh, they kinder egg. Kinder yeah. egg, yeah. yeah. Actually, yeah, no, I think yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, it's like bits. 
the right this morning. Maybe that's what size. Z29. Hi guys, what did I miss? Pretty much our entire stream. That's okay. um, But yeah, no, not a problem. Um, it, we'll be able to watch it, rewatch it on the upload, but it's always great to have you uh, on board. Thank you, Zed. Oh, Scottish Geeks is in the room. Me. Hey, Hiya. Happy New Year, Derek. Yeah. Um, I hope um, it was a good one for you. When's um, Burns Night? Uh, that's next week. I think. That's, that is, I was say, that's quite close, isn't it? That's the the big one for those in Scotland. Let's have a look. Okay. Uh, oh, did oh, he? is he? Oh no, no, it's not for a while. Twenty fifth. Twenty fifth. He's ill. Oh, is he? Are, are you suffering with? A cough and a cold and being all bunged up and fluey like we were. It's nothing too serious. Yeah, mine started, um, <laughs> I think, the day I broke up from work. And then it just all come out. So but, um, it was cold at the moment. But, um, yeah, no, I hope it's not, not anything too serious, Dan. NTSFM, female Sonic. Yes. Female Sonic. Oh, f oh. Aha, uh -huh, right, female so oh she was fair when the hand obviously was embedded in the chest and her astute and the way her mind works. Oh okay. Yeah. It spotted it. Are you going to do another stream of Mario or Tails? Are we gonna do another uh, what as in doing uh, one for Tails instead? It's quite similar to Sonic really, other than he's a fox. Yeah. But the Mario one um, check out the vote which is going to be on our community tab uh, if you want to get notifications to the community tab remember to click the notification bell by our subscribe button and you will be able to participate in the vote of what one we're going to make next because we've got Bowser in the in the voting here we've got Cat in the Hat, Bowser, Yoda, Slender Man and Sherlock and those five will be up for available for the vote from 5pm yeah. tomorrow I'll just make his head a little bit bigger and then we'll call that day. I'll, I'll probably pose him up at some point, like make one of the hands in a slightly different position. Because if you followed any of the other making of a bubblegum monsters, I tend to mention it quite a few times. It's always good to make things not symmetrical, like asymmetrical. Um, it just makes it's just more interesting on the eye when you watch, when you look at stuff. Whereas everything is perfectly symmetrical is quite boring. So I'm just going to scale up his head. A little bit. Yeah, kind of. I wonder if he would, would kind of want to do like a bit of a turn on his head, as if he's just looking to one yeah, side. Yeah, yeah, we could do, can't we? Oh, we could even tilt it forward a bit. Oh, not like that. But yeah, he needs to have his hands. One of his hands moved a bit, or something. I mean, he could even be ready to run or something. Because at the moment he's just kind of in a boring static pose. And really what we want to do is get him into that classic pose. I don't like his nose at the moment. I'm going to have to yeah, it's work on not that. quite so... I sort of see it as more of a button nose, but it's not, is it? Yeah. It's sort of... Well, we're working on all this. It will be one of those... One of those other ones I've got in the back catalog of things to do. <laughs> P. Fulcrum's in the room. Hello, P. Fulcrum. Um, we're from the UK, just south of London. MGB Gaming, could you make Charizard from Pokemon? I, I'll, I'll make a note of that, but remember that come to our next Have we not? We've got. Stream. We got oh, we did we do? We, no, we didn't do Charizard, but we did. Um, what is his name now? The Dragon One. The Dragon One. Flame, but that is Charizard the upgrade from him, I think. I think he is, yeah, he's where he goes. Yeah. On what? Why haven't we haven't got a three D print of him? Then just haven't got round to doing him as a three D print. Oh right. So we've got loads that we haven't three D printed. We've got one of Mario. Have we? Oh, that's right. Because initially, yeah, we wasn't. Yeah. Uh, um, Actually, I won't move his head yet because I want to concentrate on Doge Gaming two thousand eighteen. Hello, welcome to the room. Okay. Well, that will do for now. But I will pose him up and get him into a bit more of a, the traditional, the traditional looking kind of pose that we got here. That kind of pose. Yeah. With one hand like wagging his finger. Um. But yeah. 
That's good though, because to be fair as well, I mean, um, you come quite away with him. Yeah, he's got, not um, got most of him done. And the fact your moustache stayed on throughout the yeah, whole... I was just thinking, I was just thinking, I wonder if you stream. joined the stream and just went, yeah. oh, Sonic Hedgehog, but what's going on with that guy's moustache? Yeah. Why has he got that moustache? Um, Derek asked if we had a good time on New Year. What did you do New Year in the end? I was ill. I literally oh, right. was yeah, ill and just sat indoors. It was really good fun. I think... Um, yeah, I, it, I, it, it's just with, it's with the family. We we have our tradition is um, we have Chinese on Tia? New Year's Eve. Yeah, so they're not celebrating it, are they? No, not yeah, no, no, they don't no. celebrate. I was gonna say, I thought, no, they don't celebrate at the same time as I said. The Chinese New Year is different, isn't it? Yeah, um, but it, yeah, it all goes quick, doesn't it? I mean, the whole thing. Well, it, I can't believe we're nearly like. Well, not halfway through the month, but like a third of the way through. Yeah, well, we're near enough. What, what day? Oh no, eighth. The eighth today. Eighth today. Yeah, so about yeah. Well, good. Almost oh, third away. Um, if Freddy Fazbear's Pizza was a real place, would you want to go if the uh, animatronics <coughs> were not alive? Yeah. If it, what, what as in location if it, would you go to? Well, if it, if it was like a like a theme park kind of one, which was done based on. The sort of game, yeah. Obviously, they're not really possessed. Yeah, it would be quite cool to see. I'm surprised no one's done it yet. Um, Gabriel, who's new to the room, the, oh, she's from, from Portugal. Oh, asked, what, yeah, from Portugal. Um, asked, you never said to us whether it's warm or not, though. I wanted to know if it was warm oh, in right. Portugal in a moment, but um, that's Peter. I'm Stuart, and Charlie's back in the room. The and 23 Yes. Yeah. So, ha- as it stands. What's your avatar, Charlie? It looks like an ostrich head. Or like a cartoon ostrich. I can't tell, I can't tell what it is. But I feel it looks like it's the neck and then like these big goggly eyes and oh, beak. Oh, yeah. But it probably isn't anything like that. I don't know. I don't, can, you, can you hover on it? Does it. No, it doesn't. Um, uh, yeah, so. Obviously, there will be an update on Sonic over the course of the next few weeks anyway, like as, as you're doing the other ones, and then we yeah, get along to do with Sonic. Um, finishing off um, 2D. 2D, Remix. Um, and that's it. That is it. You, yep, so we've got Pretty much, yeah. yeah, so... You've got to print them then. So we've got to print them. Yeah, you that. Yeah, so for people that don't know, Stuart prints them as well, and then we have a shelf full of... We do, yeah. Which. We've got... We've got well, we're almost getting to the point where we need two shelves. Yeah, no, we do. I think the next one won't fit on that shelf. Can I ask you a question? You have like 63 subscribers, but only 20 are watching now. Why? We don't know. Um, it could I, be time zones. I think a lot of it is we have a lot of subscribers through ha- through our films where we... Um, obviously, people watch the film and then, and then they go subscribe and they're just kind of in for watching the film they're not really interested in us which is fair enough um, so that's kind of what happens and then you, you've you got your people that I guess enjoy actually just chatting with us yeah. which is you guys which is obviously what we're really thankful for because we love chatting with you too um, but I hope that kind of answers the question it's um, horses for courses isn't it not, not everything yeah. fits everybody yeah I mean the thing is I think a lot of these people that do live streams are vloggers and so people subscribe to them for their vlogs so then, obviously, when they do a live stream, you'll get they're getting a large percentage of their subscribers that have already subscribed because they like them as vloggers. Yeah. Whereas we get a lot of subscribers through, our, like I say, our films. So people come for the films; they don't come to watch just just chat. Yeah. Um, and the reason why we do this is it isn't really for views or anything like. That. We just enjoy chatting with you guys. It's a good way of interacting with the people out there. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, also, I mean, because it, it sort of stemmed from when people were like just. We just get emails and lots of questions and comments, yeah. They? And yeah. it all sort of started from there. And then, with the like doing the, the bubblegum monster, um, it, it was only we, you sort of decided, well, why don't we do it live? Because you used to do it privately, didn't you? You used to do like a time lapse yeah. of them, yeah. And people Which I'm trying to do as well, no more <coughs> when I get time. Um, um, I'll hopefully be more active again once I get rid of this flu. I'll say it's flu, says uh, Scottish Geek. Cause Anti SFM posters, FNAF, uh, the Joy of Creation, Chica, 
Bendy, and what is the last one? The last one is a mixture of sister location. I can't remember who did that. It's actually artwork from some of our. Um, some well, of that's yeah, from the gallery, wasn't from it? The gallery, so, yeah. The, from the gallery. I can't remember who did that one. We should put a name on it. But that one's uh, yeah, that's um, sister location, and it's got Foxy, uh, Baby, and a few. Has it got ballerina? Has it got ballerina? I can't really see. It's quite dark yeah. actually. But yeah, so there you go. Um, I will like every video you post, says Bone Dog. Thank you, Bone Dog. But if you don't like it, you shouldn't. Don't like it. <laughs> yeah, that's not a problem. Yeah. I'm crossing my fingers. You get to 100k subs. Like, yeah, so do we. Yeah, that, well, you know, it's because of you guys that we're here. So if you do enjoy it and you think other people that you know may enjoy what we do, um, then we'd love to have them on board as well. And uh, Scottish Geeks is getting over his flu, or he's hoping to get rid of his flu. Yeah. Um, and really, I suppose, is it a good time to wrap up? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. So we're going to say ta ta for now. Um, but we will play you out with our new outro and look forward to seeing, reading your comments in our Joy of Creation. Yes, yeah, so remember, check out Joy of Creation tomorrow, which is our film. Yeah. Along with Iron Cinema. So, uh, yeah, until when are we next? Well, I guess we're not live next Next Monday. Monday. So until then, see you later, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. The vote for our next live Making a Bubblegum Monster will be open tomorrow from 5pm GMT. Our next live Making a Bubblegum Monster will be on the 15th of January at 6pm GMT. Remember to check out the community tab where you get the latest news and where you can also cast your votes for the Making of a Bubblegum Monster or the Bubblegum Gallery. If you enjoy our channel and you want to become a bubble gummy, remember, hit that subscribe button. If you want to be notified of our community posts and our new releases, click the notification bell. Thanks bubble gummies and we look forward to catching up with you next week.